and a shout out to Leo Cody for sending this to me. Uh, comedian Chris D'Elia, you may know he was canceled because he said bad things and did some bad things. Canceled. Um, and we're not going to talk about that. You can look that up. That's not what this is about. But he was canceled. He was even cut out of a Zack Snyder movie. I even forget the name of the movie. It's where they it go. Was to, the zombie one. The, the, the zombie, zombie one where they go to Vegas. He yeah. was the helicopter pilot and they reshot it and cut him out of the film. Chris D'Elia canceled. However, a clip has emerged and Leo Cody sent me this clip. We're going to scrub through it. It's like a four minute comedy bit. It's about the decline of Marvel. It's about Marvel's decline. I need, I, I'm, we're going to, we're going to look at this and all he does is, I mean, there's always an any, and, and Alan, you know about this. Any really good comedy has a grain of truth, right? Mm -hmm. There's some truth that's there. Yeah. He's really just stating a truth. So uh, we're going to, we're going to look at this. Wait, I got to find the, the correct file here. Um, where'd it go? Where did it go? Uh, okay. I have to, you know what? I might have to convert this file. All right. Maybe we're not watching it. Wait, where did it go? Did it disappear? No. Hang on. Hang on. Why don't you read some uh, chat questions and comments while I, while I fix this? Hold on. All right. Uh, okay. We got, let's see. Nerd far away. Can you mute Chris Allen? I want to hear you better. I should. Yeah. Uh, oh yeah. Carolyn miss you. I miss you. I miss you too. Hey, Kara. Yeah. Someone, someone pointed out by the way that I was completely mispronouncing Kara's name. I was saying Kara. Yes, you were. Why didn't someone correct me? Oh my God. I feel yeah. so bad. Like I, I look, I, I, <laughs> It's funny. I did. I did correct it one time, but then I realized we were listening to you on something, and I had corrected you in front of her, and you weren't there. Uh, <laughs> all right. Well, there you go. All right. We're going to go back to your chat comments and questions uh, in a moment. What we're going to do is take a look at this video. I found it. It is not online anywhere, but it is worth seeing. We're going to talk about it. We're going to talk about it. And um, here we go. It's about a four-minute comedy bit. I may pause it in between, but let's take a look at comedian Chris D'Elia, and he's talking about Marvel movies. Let's take a look. Dude, Marvel is too many Marvel movies. We can agree on that, dude, all right? It's just, there's too many. Remember when they made the last Marvel movie? Remember, no, no. Remember when all the guys died in the shit? Like, everyone died in the endgame? And then what happened? After that, there was another one. <laughs> Like, right after that, it goes, everyone died, and then it was like, part two, coming up, and you're like, what? They died. Remember that? When all the fucking guys died, when Spider-Man was just like, I don't feel good. <laughs> Mr. Stark, and he just disappeared. Everybody was crying in the theater, but I was like, fuck yeah, no more Spider-Man. <laughs> we don't have to watch it anymore. Fuck this. And then what happened? They made fucking six movies with Spider-Man after that. They made six more Spider-Mans. They had so many Spider-Mans. They had the Tobey Maguire. They had the guy in the Facebook movie. And then they had that cute boy that does it now. And then they got the cart. After that, they made a cartoon Spider-Man. They made a cartoon Spider-Man. And in the cartoon, he's black, the black Spider-Man. And then they made another black Spider-Man. And in that Spider-Man, they have a bunch of other Spider-Man in it. They have a bunch of, it's like a multiverse or fucking fuck off. It's like, <laughs> dude, it, they got so many. There's a pig Spider-Man. There's a pig Spider-Man. It's a pig. That's three halves. Uh, this, okay, the fact that now, like, it's become fodder for comedy, not just articles in Variety and Reporter, admitting that Marvel's got some issues. Uh, I, I think this is great. Um, let's, let's, watch, let's watch some more of this. There's a couple minutes left. If, if the chat is cool with it, to keep playing it, yes. Okay, we're going to, is that a yes to keep playing it, Alan? Uh, half Those spider, are... half big. Here we go. <laughs> this is a joke, but I shit you not. I guarantee it. I'm telling you, this is the truth. This will happen. There will be a, a time where you, there will be a movie with a paraplegic Spider-Man. It just will happen. <laughs> it will be. He'll just be like, stop, evildoers. Fucking... <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, 
sorry, I, I can't really aim that well. I don't feel my legs. I, uh, <laughs> oops, I kicked the lady's face. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Watch out, I gotta land. <laughs> well, I guess he just scrape his face all up. Oh, it's Peter Parker. We can see his identity. Ah, uh, we gotta stop using paraplegic part Spider-Man. <laughs> We can't use a fucking paraplegic Spider-Man. And then they be, oh, because, well, oh, you're not for equal opportunity? <laughs> oh, crime is rampant. Fuck. <laughs> this, okay. I, I, I actually, I like Chris D'Elia's comedy. I had, um, I, 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 think, I think he's funny. I did have a Twitter spat with him once. Um, I don't know. It was just, it was, I, I, I was it's joking. Probably over something stupid. Well, it was definitely over something stupid. This is literally like in like 2012. Okay. He mm -hmm. was on the show with Whitney Cummings and I kind of goofed on him. Um, this is when I used to enjoy Twitter and kind of troll people um, and whatnot. Yeah. But, uh, I mean, I'll say the same thing I said about Jonathan, that Jonathan Major video, Major's video we showed last time. Uh, uh -huh. I, it's like, why are we litigating this stuff over social media? I, I have no idea. What happened? Uh, all I know is I'm supposed to believe he's he's a bad person. He may be, well, but but it's like, you know, I, I you know, I, I basically the only reason I, you know, I know that he's a bad guy is because of the mob. Basically, but look, I just want to see some funny stuff. Let's let's yeah. let's keep it going. There's just uh, we're more than halfway through. I I just I, I let's let's watch it. <laughs> I'm telling you, man, there'll be a bunch of different Avengers in a year, two years time. They'll be like super them. <laughs> be super them. That would be <laughs> like big shoulders and a pussy. Like that's what he's <laughs> like. Oh, it's a bird. It's a plane. It's oh, I can't really identify it to be honest. <laughs> help super them. Get <laughs> the woman's burning in the building. Go help her. He's like, ha hello, ma'am. I'm here to. <laughs> I'm here to help. Do, can I save you? Do I have your consent? <laughs> I can't save your life without verbal consent. <laughs> What's that? I can't hear you over the explosions. All right, your choice. <laughs> People are like, good job. Good job, super them. It was up to her and you let her... Where the fuck is paraplegic Spider-Man? We have a meeting. He's in the bathroom. The big stall. <laughs> just on the shit. I'm late. Spider-Man just shit. He's on the ceiling just plopping it in like that. <laughs> That's how I would shit if I was Spider-Man. Just up on the thing like that. Super them. Go check on fucking paraplegic Spider-Man. I would, but I can't. I'm not allowed in that bathroom. <laughs> I, I think this is, I, I think the fact that now Marvel movies are a joke, right? Marvel movies have become a joke. And this segment from Chris D'Elia, which hasn't really gone viral. I don't know how um, Leo Cody found it. He just said, hey, you should show this on your show.